Welcome to Roland University's Support Tutorials video series. Today's lesson will be setting up a GX cutter for making rhinestone templates in Arware Studio. Step 1. Set up the cutter as a printer driver. We'll begin today's tutorial by opening up Arware Studio software. Upon opening Arware Studio you'll notice that you have a blank template. To begin work today we'll click New to start a new working size. The width is typically the roll of stencil material you'll be working with and the length is approximately the size of the job. You'll see represented here on the screen 8 inches by 5 inches. To install the cutter we'll go to File, Output Device Setup which will open up the device dialog box and under Printers choose your cutter. Today's example will be GX24. Click on the Properties button to open up the Driver Properties window and make sure your cutting area is identical to your working size area, in this case 8 inches by 5 inches. Click OK to close these windows. Step 2. Create and output the design. Now that the cutter is properly installed, you can begin designing. You can work with previously made designs or start from scratch. For today's tutorial, we'll make a simple star with a simple fill pattern. We'll create our star, center it on our working size, choose the stone we wish to work with, and assign a fill pattern to it. When all designing is complete, we'll begin the process by clicking on the print button, which will open up the printer dialog box. Inside you'll see the GX24 listed, along with your working size, and in the bottom right corner you'll notice a checkbox that says printing stones and cutting lines. By checking this, you'll enable the cutter to cut out your rhinestone patterns. Click OK when ready, and once the cutter is set up, click Yes to begin cutting. This concludes our tutorial on how to use your cutter to output rhinestone patterns from Arware Studio. For more information, visit us at www.rollanddga.com.